All right. So, yeah, we've arrived at Act 4, <laughs> which... The concern is that, um... I'm gonna just do an evaluation on where I'm at. I'm gonna see what I can get my magic find up to. So, hang on. I think I need to gamble for some boots. I've also decided to sell that. I've almost leveled up. I can afford to go out there for just a little bit to level up. Well, let me use the new javelin as well, so... I don't know, I'm not convinced I should be out here, but at the very least get the level up. But yeah, I'll probably run around and go try and get some stuff. I'll get the level up and then I'll think. I'll either go back to the previous difficulty and farm a particular boss. I looked at what drops where and it's basically Act 3, the previous difficulty, and Act 1, the current difficulty. This doesn't seem bad, like, I, I don't know. Maybe this is going to be okay. I just wouldn't want to go all the way with this act. Surprise it hasn't been an elite yet, to be honest.
Okay, this... Oh! Yep, that's what I was talking about. Yeah, that's not a good sign. <laughs> Jesus, aura reaches pretty far. Wait, is, oh shit, that's another elite. Dying. All right, I gotta go back. Uh, yeah, get up to base 10. That's it. That's what that's gonna stop for now. Not here, not in town, not in town. And then there we go. I mean, in theory, everything should be stronger now. Hail to you, champion. Hail to you, champion. because she's probably stronger now. Okay. Ow. Oh, for fuck's sake. I need I need the shield upgrade. It's as simple as that. I can cope, it's it's just going to be 
going to be bad if I if I don't get this upgrade by the end of this. Okay. Clear. Alright, you're still alive. Try now. Boots, where are you? I'm looking for the heavy boots. What? Where are they? <laughs> there they are. Jeez. fire resist. They only had armor though. Ugh. Nah, we can do better. Okay. Uh, I'll keep those just as a magic find option. Can't. again. <laughs> oh, damn it, they were there. There they go. Uh, poison resistance. Uh, Yeah, those are pretty decent. I mean, for, for magic finding in Nightmare. Uh, I guess just take one of these. These are not bad. The high lightning resist, the high coal resist. Uh, 
All right, whatever. Really? That's cool, I'll, I'll just hang out. I forgot about this. Let the clench begin. What's my lightning resist that? Alright, it's actually pretty decent. I think I'm, I'm gonna be okay. It's still not good, but... <laughs> this whole area sucks. Just have to take it slowly. Give myself a nice wide area that I can run around in. What a great enemy design. Thank you. To be honest, this is kind of surprising that there aren't more of them. Because the other times I've played through this, this, this part generally takes an hour. <laughs> I, I wish I was exaggerating, but... Oh wow. He's getting wrecked by the plague. Dude, plague javelins. Alright, that was easy. Goodbye, is Wow. Okay. Greetings. Not here. Two skill choices, so let's just give them to power strike. Greetings. Okay. 
hot. That's like a almost thirty percent increased charge strike, and uh, I mean it's only two percent, but okay. Hail to you, champion. This will be fine. I think this is the part that I remember that took long. Are you kidding me? Oh my god. Wow, I just lucked out. <laughs> Ah. Okay, never mind. Dude. I'm sorry, but that's... Wow. That didn't even happen to me on normal difficulty. Alright. I'm very content with that result. Oh, fuck. Sorry, even if I have to reset, it, it's fine. As the waypoint is just out there. Jesus Christ. Valkyrie, can you can you please defend me? I am overburdened. If I can get a free kill, why not? Just running straight past her. That's not fun. Hold on. Hey, up this way, come on. What are you- what are you doing? <laughs> You're an archer, not- Okay, where are these eggs coming from?
Yeah, got it. I need to go back real quick. What do you need? Hello. Not here. Oh, that's scary. Thank fuck they can't get across this bridge. Ah. Keep going back. What do you need? I'm using the resummon as a scouting mechanism. I might need to move back depending on what happens to the right there. I'm watching that health very carefully. I think I got the elite. It's gone. Now I gotta go back again. It's fine. Hello. Hail to you, champion.
this up like this. There we go. That should get the bottom ones too. Valkyrie, please. <laughs> Intercept. Okay, just wait here a sec. Wait for the mana to replenish. I'm gonna have a drink of my coffee. Got to be close to the waypoint. Uh, is he gonna be okay? Valkyrie, are you gonna be okay? No, you are not. It's not even an elite that does that amount. Okay, I assume that leads towards... Ooh, okay. I think this leads towards the waypoint, and then back there would lead towards the quest. Alright. Let's get this out of the way. Wow, that was... Okay, just hang out here. That'll be fine. We separated him from the rest of whatever's there, so... And then I guess let's hope we get a good... Result from this. I mean, so far I've been pretty lucky. Okay. I can't carry anymore. Wait, what do you mean? Ah, okay. 
Stay a while and listen. What do you need? Slag. Holy shit. Might have to go back already. Damn it, it went under. Okay, that one's dead. No, move back. To make sure this is completely clean. <laughs> I don't want anything interrupting me here. This is where lightning fury shines. Any annoying clustering and deals with it.
man. Okay, one more, I think. Clear? I think we're clear. Please be good. Ist, not bad. That's not bad. All right, I'm happy with that. That's good. That's a good find. Yeah, I mean. It's one of the good ones, so. Greetings. Pretty good result overall. I don't think we really use Sapphire for anything. Anyway. I think I can up a rare item, which probably isn't a bad idea, like... I can make these boots better. Um, but... Okay. I'm not convinced that I'm prepared enough to go through with the rest of this act. I'll just get the waypoint and then I'll consider my options. Just the home stretch is a bit of a doozy. I might see if I can go farm a monarch. Oh shit, it's blocking me in. What the f- why are they coming from behind? Or is that just the egg being annoying? No, yeah, they're being annoying. Apparently they can lob the egg that far. Awesome, I didn't even need to come here. Oh no, there's another one over here. I gotta go back. What do you need? 
Not here. Borrowed. Wait, did it? Okay, I'm gonna wait here for mana to come back. Sip more of my coffee. Oh man. Come on, this has to be it, I think. After the stretch, surely that's the way point. Motherfucker. <laughs> Valkyrie! Hey, uh... There you go. I'm not sure in what universe standing that close as an archer is a good idea. Wow, there's still more. What? What did you- what did- huh? Where did you two even come from? Okay. We did it. <laughs> Hail to you, champion. Now I don't have to commit to this if I don't want to. What do you need? Um, let me just look at what it costs to up. I mean, these are 20%. Those are better because they have just insanely high resists. Okay, upping D2. We are up to not unique, rare. Ooh, it's an amethyst. Damn it. If it was anything but amethyst, I would do it, but it's not. Uh, Alright. Yeah, so now... What level am I? Mm. I'm just thinking if I can realistically do this.
I'll d I'm just gonna do a few of these runs now, I think. An attempt to get the Monarch. Plus, small charms that can give me resist, that's also another goal. I made progress, so that's... It's not like I didn't try. I hate these things. <laughs> they attack you and then they wimp out. It's alright, they're poisoned. I mean, the other thing I can potentially get from here is a bow for her, so... But the main upgrade would be a shield. things aren't gonna do anything to me. I could also get really good runes out of this, so... Laid back, sort of. <laughs> Run away. I don't think it matters when they're on that percentage of health, they're gonna die. probably pick up stuff as well just to sell I'm starting to like Plague Javelin quite a bit. I just wish it did more. It just doesn't clear stuff as quick as Lightning, but I mean, for stuff that runs away and for bosses, it's not bad. It's definitely more useful than it used to be. Uh, I think Devil Star is a good one. Just any base that sells well, I'll keep. I think these things are passive to me now. Ooh, 
Ooh, demon head. Uh. Damn it, it's only one. I'm still gonna take it with me. It's probably worth a bit. Greetings. Not in town. But yeah, I guess the aim of this is going to be earn money, find items, and... Oh, wait, hang on. What was this? I think it was good, yeah. It would have given me life. Alright, cool. Just anything that gives me more stats. And I'll be able to get a level or two out of this. Save. It might be boring, but <laughs> I gotta do this. I have to get that shield. I've only found one so far, and the game screwed me out of it. Why not? No, 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 no. That's got that aura. I can't tell if it died. That one's gonna die now. <sighs> Fucking hell. It's still alive. I can't have that thing be alive and running around. I think it died. Yeah, it died in this corner. Cowards. Finish what you started. You're the one empowering them. I know you're a pacifist, but you must die.
I might gamble some amulets as well. Hmm, this run didn't give me much. Okay, just check this house and then we're done. Ah, eh, grab it to sell. Why not? Not every one of these is going to be good. I made some money. Greetings. Uh, I'm gonna put the these potions in here. I don't need them. Anything that can get my fire resistance more on point with the others, I'll, I'll be really happy with. Uh, I think these are worth a bit. I don't know. We'll see. Oh wow, it didn't die. <laughs> Alright, there we go. Thank you. They sure like going for her. Hey Lola, what's up dude? Not a whole lot was watching Ozark, oh yeah. Heard good things about Ozark, haven't checked it out myself yet. Huh. 
haven't really watched any new TV shows lately. The only thing I did catch over the weekend, um, the Thor movie was on Disney Plus. I watched that. Love and Thunder. It was alright. Uh, that'll sell well. I've just been playing this through hardcore, which surprisingly go amulet. It's been going well. Uh, this will sort of average out. Fifty-five. Eh. It averages them out a bit more, which is not bad. Hmm. I'll hang on to this. Yeah, I got much on for the weekend. Oh yeah, did you see that video I put on Discord? <laughs> of the, uh, Korean pizza. Oh uh, dear. I don't know why, but like I'm on a whole cursed pizza thing. Yes, did you like it? Is it accurate? You hated it. it. The sad part is I don't show you what it turns out. You know? They leave you in suspense of what it could look like. But when the dude gets the can of corn and just slaps it on top with like... I don't know, is it a brine or whatever? It, it kind of stews in. I mean, look, I'll, I'll admit that I've been one to, like, make a, you know, the poor man's pizza with uh, slices of bread and then just pepperoni cheese and whatever toppings, right, in a grill. But, um, that, like, sweet potato and corn, nah. That's not what Korean pizza is. It's an abomination, an affront to God. <laughs> well, what is Korean pizza, though? Because the only two examples I've seen of it are that, and I've seen, uh... I'm not sure if the dragon fruit pizza was Korean, but... Or was it durian? I can't remember. Anyway. What 
do you need? For the life of me, I can't remember what's the other one, but it doesn't matter. Uh, I need to make room for this. Yeah, I got rid of this. That'll do. Devil time? Hey, don't let anyone hear you say that out loud. You might be reprimanded for putting the good lord's name in vain. Heathen. Um, this is gonna be slightly boring, just gonna put that out there. I've done... I progressed in Act 4, it's just I'm kind of at a part now where... The finale of this is... Okay, I'm sure I can get through it, it's just... My biggest concern at the moment... Is the shield I've been carrying for the longest amount of time, it's not... It's not what I should have at this point, and I'm trying to get it. The upgrade. So I'm kind of running around in this area, because you can get good items from it. It's not guaranteed. Um... Oh yeah, Lola, are you gonna be up for long? Oh jeez. Hold up. Cause I was gonna say if you are, the new Fall Guys season has started if you wanna check that out. I'm not convinced I'm gonna finish this act today. I, I did say I was most likely gonna divide this into like a couple of... Of streams, because at this point I'm not rushing anything, like, these last two acts. I lucked out with this act, to be honest. I should st I really should still be fighting my way through it, but... The map generator gave me the two exits right away, and I was able to just jump ahead to the end, which... I might be, like, behind two levels here. The only Korean pizza you've seen, pepperoni and bulgogi pizza, made from gochujang. Yo, gochujang is great. <laughs> that sounds awesome. Yeah, I love any kind of, like, chili paste, chili oil. Any of that stuff from, from Asia, it's great. You just put a little bit of it in food and it gives it... Such a good flavor. I am overburdened. My goal here is to either find the upgrade or be as close to level 80 as I can be. Fall guy sounds good, you could use a break from FF14. I imagine you're doing something similar to me, which is like, grinding. <laughs> when I started doing hardcore, I didn't think I would get this far, to be honest. I was like, hmm, give it a try, why not? But, uh, it's actually gone pretty well. I've- I've lucked out in a lot of different ways. Not here. You chop- chop trees for four hours, fucking hell. Yeah, I'm kind of at a point now where... It- everything matters gear-wise, like, I need to... There's- 
so many different things I could improve. Like these rings, for example, I'm pretty sure they're from the first difficulty. And I could probably do better, but... Yeah, anyway. Damn it. It's low quality. I will definitely do some stuff off stream for this, because <laughs> it's going to become this. Like, I'm, I'm more than likely just going to run around in this and just do that off stream for a few hours. But I'm doing it now just to kill a bit of time. You're trying to become a carpenter so you can make furniture for your guild house. The grind is real. Man. So, if you were to take a guess, how many hours collectively have you put in, and how many hours do you need to put in to reach the skill level required? Hydra Skull? I think that sells well. I think my gamble should be oriented around... I'm not even sure. Amulets? You don't want to think about that. I mean, look, it's fine. Like, I'm playing Diablo. I, I, I can admit how much time I've spent on this. Like, on my softcore character, the Amazon... The equal version of this, to get to, I guess, what is considered endgame gear for the build, definitely sunk, like, a couple hundred hours into it. And whilst I do have the items, they're not the best they can be, but I mean... It's good enough where I just run around and destroy almost everything. Um... I picked up a PS3 on the cheap. And a copy of Diablo 3 on PS3. Because, got the idea, I've, I've been thinking about the days of vanilla Diablo 3 and how different they were. And, I mean, it was fun, the full difficulty thing. But there's no way to play it on PC, because the patch is gone, right? And then, remember that, uh... The console version. I can't carry any you can play it offline. Oh, and then I remember the PS3 version was abandoned by Blizzard. Yes. So the PS3 version out of the box comes with like patch 1.03. Which is as close to vanilla as you can get. So I'm going to do that soon. The good old days where you would get enemies and you'd be like, well, time to exit the game. Truth beat. Not in town. Surprised the vanilla version doesn't exist somewhere. I think they should consider releasing a version of it that's been modified. Like, of course the, the auction house is gone, right? But, like, release a version where it's not Reaper of Souls, but just, just slightly up the rate at which you get legendaries. Not by a lot. And then, honestly, that would probably be more fun than Reaper of Souls. I don't know. 
do what they did with WoW Classic, Diablo 2 Classic, or Diablo 3 Classic. I mean, they've done well with this game, because you can play with or without the, uh, the expansion for this, so you can play vanilla on this if you want. Yeah, it'll be it'll be an interesting experience because I haven't played the story mode in Diablo three in pretty much since it released, so I don't even remember it properly. Other than Diablo ends up with boobs, it's, that's uh that's basically it. <laughs> Demon boobs. So yeah. I think it'll be interesting. It'll be one of those things that I'm either remembering it differently, or it's going to be as good as I think it is. I think... I honestly miss how difficult 3 used to be. I don't miss the fact that legendaries were rare, and I only ever found one, and... It was horrible. But I mean, having four difficulties instead of what, like 20? Okay, I think we're done here. I don't see any other place to go find armor. This is pretty much a crapshoot. I just gotta hope that I get what I'm looking for. Oh, what else? I'll pick you up to sell. <laughs> uh, I don't know. The demon boobs didn't really get much attention in that game. I think, uh, damn it, what was the boss's name? But the, uh, the spider... The spider lady, what was her face? I forget her name, but... Sort of like, semi-BDSM spider. Like, top half is human, but then the rest is, is a spider. Or humanoid, I should say. I think that's the boss I got the most attention. Sadea, so that's the one, yeah. Because of the voice actress. It was a very sultry voice. Well done on remembering the name. Oh, fuck. Gotta hit the main one. Can't take credit, you just googled Diablo 3 Spider Lady. Ah, okay. These are all good. 
good to sell. I'm going to go back and sell real quick. Good day. Not in town. Good day. Nice. Uh, damn it, it's ethereal, but it should still sell well. Mm, no, it has to be matriarch, I think. I wish there was a way to play multiplayer on it, but... Even if someone else managed to have the that version of the game, I'm pretty sure it's like long dead now. <laughs> you can't play online. The only way to do it would be like, yo, come over and play on my couch, but then the setup for that would be really strange. I can't carry anymore. Uh, I'm sure that one doesn't sell for that much. What's the time? It's 12.30, so I'll, I'll do this for, say, like, another... How long is the video so far? An hour and a half. All right. I'll do this for, like, another 40 minutes to an hour, and that should round this up. I'll either find what I'm looking for, or I'll level up. That's... That's the goal. If I do find what I'm looking for, then I will progress. But this is something that I am definitely no rush in to doing. You have an issue to report. An issue of what? Jeez, you know when I read that, I feel like... <laughs> I don't know, like, I felt like I, I was getting a work message. You know? Just that phrasing. My brain kind of defaulted to, oh, wh what is this? What now? You notice the stream has the tag mature on that. I'm not sure it's that it's accurate. Oh, that? I mean, depends what you want to define as mature. There's the concept of mature being something that you can ascertain once you reach a particular age, right? And then there's the state of maturity, which. You could be 40 and behave like a fucking idiot. It just depends which one you think it is. I was debating hanging on to this, but... I wish stash space was bigger. It's number one complaint about this is I get it. They're trying to keep this as authentic as possible, but they've already added the shared 
tab space, and, I, like, people just create extra characters anyway. Just... Make, make it infinite. You can do it. Or, like, a hundred. Practically infinite. There are mods that used to do it. We here in chat are always mature in that sense. The other night we we're, were playing Fall Guys. And apparently a particular sound I was making vibrates headphones that have high bass to the point where it's like insane. Providing like a little bit of ASMR. So I was asked to do that a couple times. How's that for mature? Oh, you say oh like as if you know what I'm talking about. Like imagine I was doing this the whole time and no one ever said anything. You think that's bad? The clip still exists of you putting your mic to your throat so you can hear you swallowing water. When did you do that? I don't know if I was around for that. I am overburdened. Oh, okay, I'm full on money. You don't think I was? It's when people kept spamming the hydrate commands. Oh no. Streamer, please deep throat the mic so I can hear you swallow. Stay a while and listen. And yes, I had to use that phrasing. Good day. They didn't believe you were hydrating, so that was your proof. Gotcha. Makes sense. Oh, it's the other one. Yeah. Maturity. So much maturity. Eh, whatever, pick it up. Uh, you know what, I'll just reset it. I mean, I'm more interested in the chests. Not in town. Yes.
I'm still very salty about <laughs> the fact. The first monarch I found, it just gave me one socket when I I put it in the cube and did the thing. Like, it could have... Oh, no. It could have rolled any combination and it would have been useful, except the one socket. Out of the four possible combinations, only one of them were useless. And of course I get the useless one. I think it ran away. That was a very scary combo. Yeah, it died. I think. If I don't see the aura anywhere, it's dead. I'm also sad to say that the, the Subway hot dog is not as great as I thought it would be. I didn't have it, but I've seen pictures of it, and it looks like it's one of those things where... 50-50, depending on the Subway you go to. I don't know if I'm willing to roll the dice on that one. I don't know, it just... It seems like it would be... Hyperion Spear, is that a good one? I can't remember. Oh, it's a spear. No, I want Javelin. I think I'd be better off making that if I really wanted a giant hot dog sandwich. Yeah, I guess. That's true. It's alright, there's more hot dog places that have appeared. It seems to be a growing trend that we're getting hot dog places. There's this food truck that does uh, Korean inspired hot dogs and they're pretty damn good. I was gonna go this week, but unfortunately... When the time came to uh, go... I had to do some stuff, and then by the time I was done, it was gone, and I was sad. Subway is probably better in Australia. Subway blows in general. I mean, just on the merit that, you know, the bread from Subway had to sort of change if it wanted to be classified as bread. I think Subway is generally better anywhere outside of the US. <laughs> Uh, that might be worth looking into. It could be an it could be an alternative I could use, maybe. Greetings. It depends how much strength is required for it. It would be a fair argument to say most things are. I think most, like very. All right. I mean, there are chains, right? But they're not like. Super chains. I'm talking highly corporate, like, conglomerate, parent company structure type chains. You know? Those are the ones where I imagine, yeah. They're always going to be better overseas. You know what's funny is that Starbucks in Australia is better. Just on, on the merit that, uh, to compete here they need to have a lot of different food offerings. So their menu, in terms of food offerings, is, is pretty vast. Because that's the only way they can comp sort of be allowed to remain open. I mean, most of the 
I think only the ones in the capital cities remain open. All the other ones closed because they went bust. Starbucks can suck at your refuse to get anything there. Good. It's not coffee, it's flavored sugar syrup. Here he goes again. It's not just me. It's another case of Americans are shocked that the rest of the world don't think that Starbucks is, like, the best. What do you mean the rest of the world thinks differently of us? Metric. What the fuck is the metric system? You guys don't use Imperial? I thought the whole world used Imperial. Man, fuck this conversation. I'm gonna go watch the World Series between two American cities. <laughs> Nothing, I'm just... Don't worry, I'm just poking fun. Don't mind me. Just out of context, that might be a, a bit confusing. I was just making fun of Starbucks. And then, by extension, just the shock that most of the world doesn't like Starbucks. You hate Starbucks? Good. <laughs> I'm content. Damn it. It was the icon, but not the right one. I can't carry anymore. No, I'm just grinding here. Yes. Not in town. Good day. Oh, it's paladin only. Okay, never mind. Your friend has an espresso machine while Kat's sitting. She invited you to use it, you please. We had one of them in the office. It was alright. It was like... If it was a time of day where the coffee places were closed, it was, it was okay. Not in town. Yeah, I'm refusing to progress. Not in town. As I'm at the end of Act 4. And there's a pretty strong chance that I might not make it. But... If I get that shield, that's a good... That's a good boost, because it's a massive damage increase. <laughs> and the defensive increase, it's everything. Um, yeah, espresso machines are not bad. They're alright. They're alright. Because you have control over it. Oh yeah, virtual hugging. I picked up a PS3 for 50 bucks. It's gonna get sent, but yeah. I went on eBay and I was like, alright, fuck it, try it. I saw an auction, it was 50 bucks. 
I thought, okay, I'm not gonna get it for 50 bucks, but let's just try. Tried it, got it for 50 bucks, so... That's a, that's a grand total of $60 to play Vanilla Diablo 3. Which, it's a price, it's the price of a game, so it's, it's within budget. And I guess if I do want to play any other PS3 games in future, now the option is there. I don't have an ETA, but it'll happen at some point. Yeah, can I say one thing about, like, those things that make foam on those coffee machines? They can get pretty rank. <laughs> not- unless you get a high-end one, they're not great. I mean, I may as well get rid of these dudes. It's free XP, they run, they don't attack me, why not? Alright, there's that level up. Um... Into Vitality. That's the other thing, is I am increasing my health, so... The grass and the foam isn't great anyway. Yeah. Yeah. Apes gone. Ooh, I think it has that aura. It's okay, they're not gonna attack me. They are pacifists since I laid their, uh, trap and called to waste. Yeah, I mean, it's one of those things about convenience, right? Like... I would- I wouldn't make fun of someone that has one of those machines at home that would let you make something of Starbucks, like level in terms of ingredients, right? But if you're going to Starbucks to get that, that I'll make fun of you. There, there's the difference. It's like, one is convenience and the other one is like, no, you're making an active choice. It's like, you're going out. I don't know about over there, but here, there's options. And that's the option you take. If you're at home, different story. It's like, do whatever works, right? It's there, it's convenient. Effort is definitely a, a factor. I can understand it. And it'll do the job, more or less. I was kind of hoping I would either get my follower an upgraded bow or the shield, and none... Neither have happened. Last time we had Starbucks, it was a rank-ass apple drink, where they didn't even mix the syrup in it, so it was sitting at the bottom. Ugh. Yeah, that's kind of concerning. <laughs> If the, uh, the ing- Damn it! No, but uh, that's not gonna- 
Um. Oh, why couldn't this be a normal monarch? I'm gonna pick it up anyway to sell, but fuck. If I repair it, it can only have three sockets max, which it's not worth the risk. Like I, c I could use this instead of what I have, and it would be decent. Oh, that sucks. Yeah, that's unfortunate. Not in town. What do you need? All right, another reset. I don't... so... Yeah, that's the thing here, we don't really do... ...that many flavoured coffees here. Aside from the, uh, like, mocha, right? Which is just chocolate. I'm still weirded out by the concept of pumpkin spice. <laughs> Where did that come from? The whole... Like, okay, it, Lelo, if you want to watch hot tub streams, go nuts. It's like, I'm not stopping you. It's content that has been cleared by Twitch. However, if I were to upload an emoji of, like, a peach, Twitch will go, nah, sexualized content, deleted. Your ability to upload emotes is now restricted because of you, the streamer, showing stuff that might not be great for children. It's kind of been getting ridiculous. I've, I've seen stuff like... Like L and F. If you have those as emotes, they can get blocked, because they're like, no single letter emotes allowed. I don't know. I'm just waiting for the day that, like, they think s the smut train emote is, uh, sexualized, and they're like, nah. I don't like what that emote is implying. Okay, but see, this is the thing about pumpkin spices. Like, I, I get what it is, but I can't picture it because we don't... The concept of what a pie is here in Australia is different. If you were to tell, offer someone a, a slice of pie, or some pie, they don't expect, like, a fruit pie. They expect something savory. So something that has meat and vegetables in it. Pumpkin pie is just not a thing we do here. I've never seen one, and I've never had one. The closest we got is, like, McDonald's and their apple pie, which is not really... It's like this deep-fried thing. I don't know how to describe it, like, the apple pie we have here at McDonald's is different. But it's this deep-fried thing, and it's pretty good. Is 
It's very crispy. Do we not do flavored lattes? No, that's the thing. Like, you go to any coffee place, right? One that isn't a chain, they don't do it. Pretty much you go there, and... Some of them might have the bottles there, but it's not on the menu. It's kind of like you have to ask. But most places don't. It's none of this, like, list five ingredients thing to get a coffee. It's like... At, at most, you're gonna say, like, the kind of milk you want. And whether or not you want it, like, extra hot or, you know, just some temperature rule, right? And that's it. Oh, and maybe an extra shot. Maybe an extra shot. If you've never seen an Australian McDonald's apple pie, Google it. Guess we're done here. Good day. Not here. Greetings. What is this? Cathans again. Ugh. That's the only ring I ever find with green. I have to keep these now. Not here. Alright, I'll do a couple more runs and then I think we can do some fall guys. Hail to you, champion. I just I just don't think I'm equipped to do this, like I want the monarch in hand. This just concerns me, but I don't know. Oh, right, I didn't reset. Whoops. Yeah, I worry that most Americans would get bored of coffee here. I don't know. The culture shock of not having... ...an array of, like, syrups and stuff available. You like black coffee? Okay, well... You can, you can definitely get that here. You would just buy what you need to make what you wanted there. You'd probably have to bring it. There's... N the, I mean, supermarkets do a few, but not that many. You'd probably end up walking into a Starbucks and maybe getting one of their take-home kits or some shit. That would be pretty funny. I 
I mean, okay, Chai, they do very well here. That's one thing I will say. I don't think you'll... I think you'll be okay with Chai. Also, my follower died, so... I'm surprised you made it... I don't know how she died, but... If I was to take a guess, she probably walked up... ...and tried to attack something... ...point blank, and just got destroyed. That's all you need, other than espresso. Yeah. You can get good espresso from the Italian places, so... What about herbal? What, like tea? Dude, tea? Are you kidding? We're a British colony, of course we know how to do tea. The, there is a very... Very big, uh... Hipster kind of tea company here that's... They do decent stuff. Uh, let me check out this flail. No, it needs to be five socket. Okay. Yeah, dude, T is T is a big thing. You'll you'll like it. I don't know if you heard of this company called T two, but uh, yeah. That's one of the major ones we have here, and they do good stuff. I should play Fortnite. I'm afraid I'm gonna have to pass on that chat member. As tempting as that is, I'm just using every last bit of energy I have in my being to resist that. As tempting of an offer as it is. Uh, yeah, I think we're done here. At Paxo is a company that does fantasy themed tea called DNT. <laughs> what kind of fantasy tea? Not in town. Not in town. I bet you the reason they get get away with it is because the tea culture is not that big over there, so they're probably just taking mixes that are a pretty normal elsewhere and just packaging it as fantasy. It's kind of brilliant.
Uh, yeah, I mean, that'll sell well. It was stuff like Under Dark and Chill, which is an Earl Grey. Definitely saw what they were doing, but a couple of them were actually pretty good. Yeah, I mean, I don't... I'm not doubting that it was going to be good. Like, I'm sure the teas are great. I just... I think it's probably just repackaging stuff that already exists. Like, I, I don't think they'd be unique, let me put it that way. I think... They probably got, like, a bunch of fancy teas from elsewhere. And then they're calling them whatever they want to be, like, to make them fancy. Like, I don't think- I don't think they went to the extent of, hmm, what would an- what would an orc tea be like? Let's try and get those notes in. You know? Or like, when people do cocktails, right? Like, effort goes in, I think. In terms of making the cocktail have a particular colour. And sort of suit a theme. I could be wrong, but I, I just have that feeling. But they probably didn't go to that extent. Thank you. Yeah, run into melee range, yeah. Shoot your bow from 30 centimeters away. Don't hang back and snipe like an archer should. Burn shield, eh. Okay. Let's see what this is. No. Nah. Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> was that two campfires? I think that was two campfires already. I can't carry anymore. My follower just doesn't learn. You did you did get a f hydro flask for them that has an infuser. Yeah, you told me about that. That sounded pretty legit, actually. I imagine T2 here sells it, but I haven't gotten into the whole, like, doing infusion type stuff, you know, having... The hardcore tea detail where you have to take measuring cups and that sort of thing and put tea leaves in and do it yourself. I'm still about the tea bags. Yes. Not in town. Hello. Oh, man. Twitch chat makes me laugh sometimes. Not in town. I mean, every now and then you, you just get, like, the whole... random message and then disappear into the evening type deal. You know, the PS4 moment. As I affectionately call them. Yeah, I remember the loose tea set you were uh, you posted. You should look into. I don't think 
I think T2 has an American presence now, so you can order tea from this company that is pretty big here in Australia. I would recommend it. They do some pretty good stuff. Oh god. That was scary. Thank you. Hannah! You probably will rip your wallet. They are a little pricier than than you might uh, be used to. Especially when it comes to tea, but it's worth it. Depends what kind of tea you like, but if you like one that's kind of sweet, there's one called New York Breakfast, which is pretty good. It's like a, a twist on English breakfast, but it's New York. All it takes is one bad elite, and then that's it. It's over. This is why I'm adamant here. <laughs> I'm not... I'm not giving up on my hunt for this shield. I've sunk too much time into this. Okay, like... Reasonably speaking, I could probably... Like, it's within reason I think I could get through the rest of this act. It's just... I've had a couple of moments at the end there where it... Very close calls, and I'm 90% I'm sure that in this difficulty I would die. The bare minimum I would want here would be an amulet that gives me plus skills. Because then that indirectly affects my tankiness. And damage output as well, so... I'm gonna gamble for some amulets. What I would want out of this would be plus one to skills. Or something that... What's my current amulet? Yeah, see, it would have to be really good. I'm not gonna be able to do many. One that has magic find for magic finding and nightmare would also be good, but... Uh, I've already got one that's 30, so that's fine. 35? That I think that's better. I think that's better. I can't remember. I think it's better. Pretty sure it is. Okay, put that there.
Hmm. All right, I think that should do it. Yeah, no luck. Okay, let me. I'm gonna test the waters here. I'm going to see. How I fare here. If I see any health dips, I'm bailing. Even if I don't necessarily get to Diablo. It's actually not bad. Oh. I've gone the wrong way. Wait, what is this? Oh, damn. That stuff you got from Paxu looks pretty good. I like the ramen artwork one. <laughs> it's pretty nice. The guy who's just said Fort and I have cruise missiles on their way to their house. Listen, people like that, honestly, that general trend is they pop in, they say one thing instead of hi, and then that's it. You don't hear from them again. And then the next time they turn up, they're like, hey, remember me? I generally either don't say anything or just like acknowledge the comment in a minor way and move on. Besides, I don't meet the prerequisite of Fortnite, like I don't have a 12 inch dick. To play Fortnite you need to have a huge cock. And I mean like baguette size, you know? Otherwise, you just can't win in that game. As we all know, there's correlation to victory. Come on, I heard you can play as Goku from Spider-Man now. Yes. This is a little awkward. Sling your balls over your shoulder. That's how that's how big you should be to play Fortnite. Sling them over your shoulder like a scarf. Alright, memes aside, there's 
there's nothing wrong with Fortnite. It's just... I know it's a successful game and people have a lot of fun with it, but it's just not for me. I generally tend to stay away from games that attract more of a younger audience, if you know what I mean. Hello. Hail to you, champion. But in general, the shooter battle royale format doesn't work for me. Because I suck at sniping. So if if I'm stuck with sniping stuff, then I'm gonna do poorly. It's an advertisement disguised as a game, a decent game, but granted, but still. Yeah, I mean, look, it is what it is. It's as successful as it is. For a reason. I mean, it does attract a certain kind of crowd. I seem to be fine. The Plague Javelin is, is pretty good. Also, the Valkyrie, I'm sorry, is, like, <laughs> super invaluable. Yeah, I wouldn't say, like, Fortnite for me isn't bad because it's popular. I just, I don't know. I think it's got more to do with the crowd that plays it as opposed to the fact that it's popular. You know what the, the, the best way to describe it is like, it's almost like a junk food, what do you in terms of gaming. What do you need? It's one of those things that I'm sure in small doses it's fine, but if you do too much of it, it's, uh, it's not great. Yeah, fast food gaming. And in the context of little kids, too much fast food for little kids is not a good thing. That's the analogy I'm, I'm going with here. There are other games that are like that as well, like, I, I think Roblox is a bit like that as well. I'm not saying that Roblox is a bad game, I just, again, the, the junk food analogy. Wow. 
Like, most of us partake in junk food, but I think a lot of us can moderate it, but those that don't, it's, it's not good. Oh my god, this whole area is obnoxious, but... Roblox is games within games, and it's completely true. Yeah, I know what it is, like... And again, I understand why it's popular, however... It does ac attract a certain type of crowd. It's not to say that everyone plays that game is in that crowd, but... Man. All games in that category would be like Roblox, Fortnite, and Minecraft. I think Minecraft is... I don't think it falls into that category as much. It, you definitely have it, but not as strong as Roblox or Fortnite, I would say. I think for me, to be honest, Call of Duty falls more into that category than Minecraft. Because now they have it on mobile and it's more accessible than ever. And again, it's, it's junk food. <laughs> the same with FIFA. Like any other sports games. I think Minecraft is fine. It does have a particular crowd though, I will say. Like, there are some people that genuinely get angry if you even mention the T word in the same sentence as Minecraft. And vice versa. Which... okay. Yeah, I mean, I... I sort of disagree with the Minecraft falling into the same category. Hail to you, champion. I think the value Minecraft has is it can spark imagination and creativity. Or as in Fortnite, no. Roblox, if you're creating one of those games or like a world, sure, but if you're just partaking and constantly just partaking, I would say no. Look, I'm not gonna- I'm not trying to, like, get on my high horse here, because... <laughs> I've con- I've- as a kid, I- I- I can't say that I only played stuff that was, like, something that improved the mind and spirit, right? But, those games were nothing like that. What? I gave her the potion in time. Oh my god, these... It's those things in the corner, I need to get rid of them. They're so irritating. Not here. Good to see you. Not in It's pretty much everything leading up to this that's the annoying part. It's not Diablo that I'm concerned about. What do you need? You love Minecraft, you just think the community parts of it are highly influenced by some of the big content creators that play to a younger crowd. Oh yeah, no, I I definitely agree on that front. <laughs> no, 
not every content creator does it. To be fair, like some of them, it's genuine. They have a love for the game, but then there are others where it's like it's clear that their mark, like their market, is children. Basically, they recognize that they can behave in a certain way, and then their videos will uh, be liked by that audience. It's like over-the-top reaction videos, you know? Like, there's this, there's this one dude I can think of that popped up in my feed when I was, uh, like, opening Pokemon cards. The dude just goes over-the-top about it, and it's kind of like, yeah, I mean, you don't- you're not naturally this way. And you're doing this purely because you know that it appeals to, like, certain children. Like, the guy jumps out of his chair and sometimes throws it and it's just like, yeah. It's not to say everyone's like that, but they do exist. It's like, sometimes I'll have loud reactions and things that may be a bit over the top, and they might break me, but it's because I'm genuinely enjoying it. It's not because I'm thinking, okay, I need to react in this way. Like the dedicated Wham Kid, yeah. Methinks I'm probably not ready for this. And I've been doing so then you can't say I didn't try, and then I just want to make it obvious that I need either more power or more defense, one or the other. It's those Doom Knights, the ones that constantly debuff you, that's what makes this a grind. Anyway, I mean, I, I, to summarize, I think enjoy whatever content you want to enjoy, right? That's fine. But I, I will point out that <laughs> some of it... It's a bit junk foodie. Yes. Not here. And all this from, like, one person just dropping a semi-derailing comment. In summary, such as the thought, I, that would be funny. You know, if I, <laughs> if I ever wanted to get completely banned off the platform one day, I'd just, like, stream to Fortnite, but then just put something that obviously isn't Fortnite and just leave it running until someone finally reports me.
like, I don't know, maybe have a play play through a Sesame Street game that teaches you stuff, and then play that endlessly on loop. Some sort of edutainment kind of game, you know? An endless loop of a game of Pong. No, but it has to be a commentary on, like, that it's junk food. It has to be something where it's, like... Learn. Go learn something. Go do something. Holy shit, dude. The, that Valkyrie can take quite... Quite the beating. I think the name of the game isn't to get banned, alright? That's not it at all. It's just... Having a subtle way to say, hey, this is junk food. I would never do it. Okay, so here, the way I'm going to play this, I'm pretty much going to drop a teleporter, hit the button, and run. Because I don't want to be anywhere near this when this spawns, because it, it can back me into a corner and I could die. Okay. Spawned it. Get out. <laughs> Greetings. Hello. Not here. Because I don't know what it's going to have, like, and if it has any sort of aura that reduces my, my resistances, uh-uh, we're not being anywhere near that. I think I've exceeded my expectations here, to be honest. Like, I was surprised that I could get to hell. Let alone up to this point. I just remember the first time I played through this, and just how much of 
a pain in the ass what it was and how many times I died. But then again, I, I guess I am playing extra cautiously. Wow, that thing died very quickly. I know the next one won't be as easy because it's going to be immune to poison. Ow! The other one is still alive, I, I, I can't get to it. Is it dead? I can't, alright, I can't see. Uh, I don't think this one spawns anything. Okay. Ooh. Getting closer. That's a, that's a bail right there. Fall, guy, fall guys will happen as soon as I die slash complete this. <laughs> At this point, that's that's the result here. It's like I'm either gonna succeed or I'm gonna flop. Hey, Miss Pendulum in the music. Oh. <laughs> I forgot I was broadcasting it. I'm glad it works. Uh, I need to... Okay, there we go. It's off. It's <laughs> more of them. I mean, if there's one thing this area is good for is leveling up. Okay, uh, you might want to move.
Holy shit, these things are tanky. Should be okay. I might have to go back. I am overburdened. Stay a while and listen. Hail to you, champion. What do you need? I got this. Yeah, honestly, this wouldn't be possible without her, like... There's a reason early on I wanted to get the armor that gave you a high-level Valkyrie right away, but I couldn't get it, because the game was an arsehole. But then, eventually, the leveling caught up, so it's fine. Just... This is definitely more viable than I thought it was. I wasn't expecting her to tank this much. There's another elite in that corner. Like, they, they're buffed. Like, why can't I be that? I should be that tanky as a melee. Like, I don't understand this. That's the one thing that slightly annoys me about this game is, like... Melee just has such a hard time. It really does. Between curse and stuff that lowers your immunities, it's just insane. You have to have life leech, pretty much, or it just doesn't work. Ah, that's what was doing it. This isn't even the build I want to run with, ultimately. Like, I want to go a physical build, but it's not viable unless I find a particular glove that gives me life leech. Same tactic as before. Pop the seal, go through the teleporter, and then walk back up. Okay. Hang on, I'm gonna wait for this to wear off. There we go. Okay, teleporter... Guess until then it's Valkyrie meat shield strat. Yeah, I mean, look, the way this is gonna work is I'm gonna finish the campaign, probably with this build, and then afterwards I'll be playing it offline trying to see how far I can get. Where I might check in every now and then and be like, yeah, I'm playing this on stream today. But for the purpose of content and stuff that goes on YouTube, I'm hoping I can get through hardcore. I mean, I'm almost there, just got off not fuck this up. Alright. Walk it up. The weird thing is, well, I guess, I think it's because bosses have an effect that do more damage to summons or something, but she can't tank bo a boss. 
which for this I'm going to try the cheese that I usually do. Okay, did it summon them? I should be able to see from here. Yep. Oh, fuck. Oh, they, they tear through her very quickly. Thank you. Hannah, you idiot, what are you doing? Okay, run, 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 run. I think for this to work, I need to separate them a bit more. Oh, it's multi-shot, that's why. Fuck, that's obnoxious. Yeah, I can't get anywhere near that. That's why she's dying so quickly. Flames aren't reaching her, so we should be able to get rid of the minions at the very least. That'll soon change. Dude, extra strong multiple shot? Oh my god. That's disgusting. It's alright, now there's less of them, she can tank that. Okay. There's probably still another one alive around here somewhere. Yep. Scratch that. Three. Oh, wow. Uh, see, this is what I, like... As a melee, how the fuck are you supposed to survive that? Like, that particular circumstance right there, like, that's just fucked. This game is great, but it, it, sometimes it has glaring issues around melee. Okay, I think that's all of them. Alright, clear. This one shouldn't summon anything. Alright, one more to go. I'll probably go and try and find more... ...full potions. Just have a bit more of a safety net, you know? It's easy enough, just go back to Act 1. Just farm a bit there. Killing a few elites should give me what I need.
<laughs> so many of them. Hang on. Get this one here. Why is she dying so quickly? It's probably the, the multi debuff. Oh, she's poisoned, maybe. I don't know. What are they healing? Oh, Alright, it doesn't matter. It was healing off something. <laughs> Valkyrie, please! <laughs> Take... <laughs> Take the aggro. <laughs> Sure. Okay. Uh, same deal as before. Put this. Open the seal. Go back to town. What do you need? Cut her some slack, she's tanking with no healer. I'm the healer. I just re-summon her. It's a, it's a full restore. <laughs> Not sure that counts as healing. Well, the health goes from nothing back to full. Okay. Ooh, yeah, that's that's scary. Holy shit, did they dispose of her very quickly. What the fuck? It's that aura. Uh, the viable support roles in D2. Uh, Paladin, I guess, technically. With the auras Paladin gives. Like, just your sheer presence and conviction aura would be enough. It's similar to Monk, I kind of like Monk and its auras are always welcome. Run. 
not even death can save you from me. Good evening. I just want to be there because that's there's a skill up shrine, which means I can do more damage. But on top of that, all right, I'm gonna go back back to Act One just to quickly get some more rejuvenation potions. Uh, let's go Black Marsh. Should only take a couple of elites and then I should find it. There's, okay, I mean, that counts. It's not a big one, but it doesn't matter. Okay, ow. I'll get a couple more. I just want to make sure that I can panic button my way out of anything. Oh, there goes Hannah. Again, acting like she's a melee character. I gotta go back. It's all right. I might have to walk this up, but it's okay. Greetings. Good day. Good day. <laughs> Raving it up to the playlist. Oh, dude. I made a new one recently that like just contains house music from, like, the era when I was going out. I've been jamming to that lately, but I didn't feel like that today. I might put it on during full, guys. Just a couple more. Okay, there's a full one, that's good. Oh, eh, I mean, whatever. I like listening to this stuff when I'm just grinding for items. <sighs> it's sad that I can't do this on Twitch, but you know, it is what it is. Okay, I can get my... my plus to skills either way.
I'd be comfortable with one more potion. Might not give me it. I just would hate to start this and then not have enough, you know? Oh, Hannah. Oh, shit. They killed Hannah. She just keeps running in. Jesus Christ, dude. Didn't even give me the potion. Uh, I don't know if I should settle. Alright, come on, you. Hand it over. Nah. Yes? Fuck it. I'm gonna go do it. Not in town. What you need? Mm -mm -mm -mm. Okay, so... The way this is gonna work is I'm temporarily hiring a different follower. Yes, citizen. Okay. Uh, Emilia, yep, Emilia. Put that to good use. I'll put that to good use. Thank all that's holy. The cheese is this particular item. When multiple melee. One, it prevents healing, so the boss can't heal. Two. If we attack from all angles, Diablo shouldn't be able to move. That's the strategy. Whether or not it goes down that way, that's a whole other thing. Yeah, what the hell do you want? Okay. I gave you everything, right? Oh, hang on. One thing I will do. I'm go Just in case this shit goes south, I will... In the name of future attempts. Alright. 
put that in here so then it's backed up. I know that's using strong hedging language, but... Hopefully he doesn't run to me right away, and I can sneak this in. Okay, nice. Okay. Guys, I need your help. Perfect. <laughs> Fucking worst off for the win. Alright. That item, by far one of the best items in the game. I've, n I've never seen the item recommended anywhere, but like... I discovered this kind of when playing with Cat, like, I had this item equipped and then it was like, wait, why isn't he attacking? And he just would never do his attacks. I am over with two players, it's more likely to happen, but, I mean, that was still pretty good. He only did lightning twice, as opposed to constantly spamming it, so. Alright, that worked. Didn't really get anything for it, except, uh, just the satisfaction that I beat it. What do you need? But, uh, I mean, that's all you need sometimes. I'm just looking at that. That's not a bad javelin. How much does it do compared to mine? 30 to 145. It's got a large damage spread. Nah. I'm definitely going back to collect a couple more items just to... I am overburdened. Oh, I guess that's it. All right. Hello. Not here. All right. Well, that's Act Four. Hail to you, champion. Um, I should probably rehire my old follower, but for now I can't be bothered. Not in town. And we arrive in Harrogath. If you Afternoon. Not here. But this is where I'm going to leave it for Diablo for now. Good stuff. Final act. <laughs> this one will involve a bit more grinding, for sure. Um, maybe I'll do a bit of it off stream, but for now, uh, yeah, next time we'll continue. Alright, I'm going to stretch my legs for five minutes and then I'm going to do some Fall Guys with Lelo.